the highest six movies on flights in, to token in Dubai. So I guess it's token 2020. Is that what it is? Token 2024. And then somebody's like, oh, is it Photoshopped? Is it real? It's real. You know, free on YouTube. So you can watch on it's on YouTube and stuff. And then, uh, right, let's take a fly. What a joke. And then this one, though, this has will have absolutely zero effect on the RH ecosystem. It's dead in the water. There's no interest or demand, and nothing will change that. After three years, we have a cumbersome, late, shit copy of ETH, which is hard to use and ugly AF. Is it hard to use? I'm not sure. I get that point. And if you're hanging your hat and you thought the RH would deploy saxophones and pump the prices, this is a sad state of affairs. What effect did him buying 17 million worth of Pulse X have? Oh, that's right. People dumped and they're worse off than before. Well, I mean, I guess if they dumped, they would have been able to sell and get that order execution. So there's at least that. Just want to be fair on that one. The sharks who have positions waiting for another such event in which they can transfer the sack funds into their wallets. This almost sounds like a pro, I guess, if you're looking to, you know, you know, get get your orders filled in that way. We're in a bull market and these coins have done absolutely nothing but continue to trend downwards. That's just factually, I'm going to call it incorrect on that one because the chart says it went up for a while, at least. I think it's time everyone comes to term with this being a monumental failure. I'm not ready. My body is not ready for that one. My body is ready for a lot of things. It's ready for up only. It's ready for up. It's ready for, I mean, honestly, just if you forget the price chart for a moment, everything else is going up. For the most part, maybe emotions go up and down, but it's 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 one of those, you know, when do I look at the price? Right, I've talked about this before on Twitter and otherwise. When I'm going to buy to see if it hits my too cheap threshold, and otherwise, when I'm going to sell, take profits, or more eloquently move into stable uh, stable uh, pair asset uh, where LP position to get liquidity over time when the price moves up, for example, uh, or if I'm leveraged in some way and I need data to make a decision whether to close or position or stay and all this stuff too. If I'm not doing one of those things, I cannot care about what the price is. And I do not make it, I do not use it to make me feel good or bad on a daily basis. I go out of my way pairing uh, to avoid pairing my emotional state to the price chart as much as possible. So I don't even know what the prices are. Literally, I was, I was prepping for the stream earlier today and I had like, I was just avoiding even looking at the price. I just don't care. I don't want to look at it and then make some judgment call, which has no effect on me whatsoever. Like it has no material effect. So I'm sure if it was up a lot, I would hear it on Twitter and, uh, you know, but I just can't care about this stuff. So what I do care about though, is are we adding new users? Are we adding or losing devs or community members? Uh, are the wells moving thumbs around to prep for bigger moves? Perhaps is the bridge number stable? Is it going up, going down? Are key products launching to enable more healthy games for users to play and lock up more TVL on the network? That kind of stuff I want to pay attention to. And I think it's much more useful, at least for me, my position with my knowledge and my, you know, what I care about to do that instead of looking at charts every day. I'm not a TA guy. So, and, and for me, and I would, I'm going to speculate 99% of other people are in a similar, similar ordeal, you know, ordeal. I say ordeal like it's, it has a negative connotation, a similar, I'm just going to say boat. Uh, T is not a thing anyway. So, you know, for me, I concentrate on ROI on time and uh, energy and it's just not there uh, looking at stuff. So that's why I cannot look at hex prices, pulse chain prices, uh, core coin prices right now. I, I can't care about it. It doesn't do anything for me to care about them today. Yeah. So unless you're timerizing this to sell today, when I, that, that's an individual thing, that's not mine. That's like a whole different thing. Um, so yeah, don't forget don't forget why RH is here, right? Let's go to this real quick. So from my point of view, this is Richard Hart's mission. I'm going to make everyone who believes in what I believe very rich. We're going to fix the world and nobody is going to stop us. That's what I believe. I don't think it's a hard thing to believe either. I think there's a lot of things to add up to that being uh, quite, quite a possibility too. So that doesn't mean there's any certainty in, in anything. But it just means that, hey, and it, this isn't like anyone who buys Hex or anyone who does this. This is believes in what I believe. This could mean a lot of different things, right? It could mean, you know, again, all the principles, all the, um, you know, privacy and freedom of speech, all the stuff too. So there's a lot of different ways to look at it there. And yeah, I just don't think it's very useful to, to look at all the, 
I, I don't know. It, it, it is up to individuals. It really is. Like, there's some people who aren't getting their needs met in this ecosystem. I, I can imagine, right? You probably talk to them. But there's no guarantee that everyone's time horizon, everyone's needs, everyone's, you know, expectations, right, will be met or should be met. It's not how the universe works, right? So don't get all spiritual, philosophical or anything like that. I'm just saying in general, it's, uh, yeah, again, I'm here to get a fair shot, a fair shot to get rich, richer, wealthy, wealthier, all that type of stuff. Have a community that cares about things that are actually uh, helping the world. That's why I'm here. So everyone's everyone's sat on their own, but I'm I'm good. I'm good here. <laughs>